All right, what's up, guys? We're back, still at CES 2020, and it is still live in the LG area. Like, they've taken up a lot of square footage in this place. Come over here real quick, I wanna show you this. So we're in the Ultra Gear department, and this is where we see all the nice monitors and displays that they have. So we're gonna talk to my man, Greg. Greg, are you ready for this, Greg? Let's get Greg in here. Let's do it. So let's talk to my man, Greg. He's gonna explain some of this stuff to me because you know I'm not an expert in this kind of stuff. So let's go ahead and talk about it, Greg. All right, so what we're showing here is our gaming monitor lineup. This is our 27 inch GN 950 series. It's going to be our IPS one millisecond response speed, uses nano IPS to give us cinematic colors that cover at DCI-P3, high level specification. This also supports 144 Hertz refresh rate but it can be overclocked to 160 hertz, so making it really, really, really fast. This is a 4K gaming monitor, so 3840 by 2160 resolution, and is NVIDIA's G-Sync compatible. So that allows us to match the frame rate of the monitor to the frame rate of the video card, so whenever we're have, doing anything on screen, the action will be absolutely buttery smooth. Nice. So is any of this going to help me not die so much when I'm playing my games? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. <laughs> Number one, you know, with the IPS, that means it's very responsive to ch changes in the input. So everything will stay sharp in detail. So you won't see the guy that you're chasing after get blurry as you're trying to chase him down. Uh, anything that can make me a better gamer is legit because I'm terrible. So originally we looked at a 27 inch. This is 34 and it's ultra wide. So you get that wider you know, more landscape sort of look to it, similar to a letterbox movies, you know, widescreen. Yeah. Now, very similar to the other monitor that we looked at, this one is larger. It is still one millisecond IPS response speed. We have nano IPS for the color, 160 Hertz overclocking for the refresh rate and still supporting NVIDIA G-Sync. And this is an HDR 400 monitor, which means that it's relatively bright. Our other monitors in the series are HDR 600, but okay. wow, look at the expanse. Yeah, it's just, man, <laughs> wow. All right, that, that really looks great. You look wow. really just totally enthralled. You, your mouth is hanging open. Yeah, <laughs> it's like, wow. Yeah. <laughs> well, if that's making you say wow, then this is gonna make you say wow three times. We wanna go look at the 38 inch version okay. of our gaming monitor. So let's go take a look at that. More is better in this case, right guys? Let's More, go. bigger, better, what all is, the above. What is this? <laughs> what, what are you doing here? What, what is all this? Hey, you said bigger was better. Now take, this is a 38 inch, 4K wide resolution, 1600 you know, pixels tall. Uh, we've got three of them tied together and all of those great features. One millisecond, uh, IPS one millisecond. So as he turns the corner, you can still read the words on the side of the racetrack. Wow. You know, the color, nano IPS gives us DCI Pre-3. It's cinematic color in a video game capability. Also means that anybody that's doing any kind of content creation, photography, videography, this monitor will allow them to see the full fidelity all the way up to what they're using in Hollywood. And again, high speed, 144 Hertz, 160 Hertz overclock, NVIDIA G-Sync, so no matter how fast he goes, how best the video runs, it's always smooth, it's always detailed. It is the ultimate gaming experience. It's Ultra Gear from LG, and we just need to get you in that seat and get yeah, you experiencing it. I have seen one hiccup, and it's totally immersive. If we put you in that seat, we may have to pry you out of it yeah, to go anywhere you, else. If you get me in there, CES is over for me. I'm just gonna hang out here, bring me some snacks or something. That's all right, we just make sure somebody is in that chair driving at all times. So we can make you the person to lead into the show. I'll sign up. Well, thanks a lot, Greg. I really appreciate your time and showing us this. Thanks, Antoine. Appreciate you coming in. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?